Okay, hey water signs. We're gonna start with Pisces today, but I wanna tell you that this is going to be for um, the end of February. The reason I say that is because yes, I know we have a new moon coming on Friday, um, but that full moon in Virgo, on February 24th, guys, that is looking a little crazy. So I think that we should probably look at that, okay? For Pisces, let's get to you guys a Oracle first. Pisces, Oracle, Sun, Moon, and Rising. Reawaken. Okay. All right. Um, Pisces, I don't know which deck to use today. I'll go with this one. For Pisces, Sun, Moon, and Rising, what does the full moon in Virgo look like? For Pisces. Full moon in Virgo. I'm getting my toes shoot on by a dog right now. Ooh, oh, Pisces, oh shit. <laughs> Pisces, this person could be at a distance or is acting distance, but there is a chance of a reconciliation. Damn. We don't even have a retrograde going. What does this reconciliation look like for Pisces? You're in the upright. Again, I'm seeing a trip or some sort of distance. Oh, I see you guys. Pisces, if you are involved with a fire sign or have been involved with a fire sign, there will be a reconciliation around the full moon. For sure. Okay. Pisces, for the full moon, what else do they need to know? Full moon in Virgo. Pisces, you may not be speaking to somebody around the full moon. Could be an earth sign. I do see some sort of argument taking place. I'm seeing a financial matter come up as well. That might put you out a little bit, okay? I don't think it's huge. I don't think it's a huge matter, but it's just something maybe you've forgotten about or something that comes up unexpectedly. Continue for Pisces around the full moon. Virgo. Pisces, somebody's going to get very, very hurt during this period of time. This could be you or somebody else realizing there was absolutely no growth in the process. This is for everybody's best interest, okay? This could be a coworker. This could be a friend. This could be a lover, whatever the case. Pisces, sun, moon, and rising for the full moon. What is the full moon going to bring? some arguments arguments about where your priorities are where somebody's priorities are in a manifestation somebody's holding back some sort of emotion as well this manifestation has to do with your stability you don't want to walk away you're in a healing process right now whether it's you know, healing from something that's happened to you recently or healing from some relationship, but there's a very big healing situation going on. I do actually think that this full moon may be very beneficial to, to you, um, e even if it's chaotic, I think it might be. Would you stop? Pisces, sun, moon, and rising. What else would you like them to know for this full moon? not being left out finances are going to look a lot better some of you might be moving on to some uh, new career choice or even like starting something on the side um it's a slow process but it's going to benefit you in the long run i do see something coming to light something pisces there's something that you've been sort of like if not ignoring um not being realistic about okay and that is around this full moon you know or after depending on the timelines something is going to like it's like oh okay you know you 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 clean the glass it's now very clear why is the wheel of fortune in the re reverse why is the wheel of fortune in the reverse you're also in the reverse
No forward movement with some sort of... Um, so for some of you, this might be a, a, a business venture. You're going in with you know, business partners or something and it doesn't work out the way you think it's going to. For some of you, this could be a work thing where you don't get you know, uh, the, the position, the pay raise, whatever you expected. Um, <clears throat> for, um, I guess, uh, for a select um, uh, some of you, just for some of you, you may have a falling out with a friend or um, it doesn't look like a love situation, so that's not a, that's not a thing, but you know, some, expect something a little turbulent to happen, okay? Something that you expected to go well and it doesn't could be with an air sign or an Aries. You're gonna lose your passion for something around this time as well. It's nothing you wanna like fight about. It's nothing you want to like, like make a big deal about, but it's sort of like, um, uh, you know, maybe, maybe you were like really, really into something, you know, full force going at it. And then when you, you know, it's sort of like it got so stagnant or it just didn't go the way you wanted it to and you're just like, forget it. And kind of like throw it out the window. Um, <clears throat> again, it's nothing you wanna like spend a long time thinking about. I feel like somebody may have ruined it for you somehow for whatever reason. Pisces around the full moon. Somebody may be giving you a gift um, this gift will come around the time you burn a bridge with somebody. So maybe you get a gift from somebody that you stop speaking to or you leave out. Um, this person or yourself feel like, feel like there's not a lot of options here. It's almost like a, a last ditch effort. There is an air sign in your energy, Pisces. They, I think they want to get together. Um, this person may have like a, um, may have like a, an affection for you that you're not aware of. Um, they may, ha they, they have an affection for you that you're not aware of. This is probably somebody you already know. There could be an argument about it as well. Something will come to the surface and be illuminated for you. And what is that? I feel like they stalk your social media or if you're not on social media, they're definitely watching you, okay? Pisces, you're headed in the right direction. Whatever you're doing with justice and the four of wands, keep going, keep going. I, I, I actually really do like this reading and I really do think that, that the full moon is probably going to trigger something, you know, um, it, it, obviously a lot of changes, but trigger something that makes you like more motivated, happier, um, more settled. Pisces, sun, moon, and rising. What else do you want them to know for this full moon? Stop. I think that the day of the full moon is going to go quite well for you too, because we have a lot of full moons here, um, with a lot of like very positive cards right after. Pisces. Pisces, you might be drinking a little bit after, this is after the full moon starts to dissipate, okay? Um, having some heartfelt conversation with somebody that you are um, sweet on with the two of cups here. Maybe talking about, definitely having conversations about money and about a more stable relationship, okay? Something that's a little more long lasting or maybe um, uh, more official, okay? Pisces, sun, moon, and rising. Yes, oh, yes, I know I have a washing machine behind me, Pisces. I, I had a new one installed and I have to get rid of this one. So yes, I've got a giant washing machine in my bedroom right now. Pisces, whatever this situation is, I feel like you guys can, can heal from it. Um, if you, it, I don't, you, you're on two sides of the spectrum, the two of you, okay? But I feel like you could come together. We have the Ten of Swords in the reverse. We have both of you guys, the King and the Queen. Um, I feel like it's, it's very possible this person could have water in their chart as well. 
I think it's very possible that that things can be mended here. If it's not a lover, it could be just a very close friend or family member. However, again, it's so it's repeating. However, I do see something going wrong here with an earth sign and change coming. I almost feel like you're going to cut this person down and I, I don't know why. Why is this? Because we have your card, their card, theirs is in the reverse. And then, you know, death is kind of like just, just chopping it down. No passion. Pisces, it looks like you want to take care of you right now. It looks like you want to focus on your money and taking care of you right now. Perhaps this is a, a family member or friend that just really like, you know, was, was um, zapping your energy or was you know, preventing some sort of happiness for you, however, whatever that looks like, okay, with the, with the wand, ace of wand in reverse, maybe they didn't, you know, Pisces, I see you getting into a relationship, I do, I drew it twice, I drew it twice, I do see some, all right, so somebody's going to be getting a headache or a migraine or something, Okay, and I also see somebody else with, for those of you that fast, please be careful. Um, I do have these weird senses, like I see I'm getting flushed right now. My stomach started turning. I started getting nauseous. That only happens when I'm about to tell you something to do with your health. Oh my God, look at how red I'm getting. Um, somebody could be fasting and, you know, end up with like low blood sugar or um, some sort of ailment due to it. So that is a warning, okay? Um... I don't think I see anything else for you, Pisces, but let me take a quick look. I'm seeing Boston. If it's not Boston, it's a town that looks like Boston. I'm seeing the Bayou as well. And a church is relevant. Hope this helps.